Hi everyone, this is Danny for Do Tech and welcome back with a brand new video. So in this video and after Apple has been released the new and the absolutely beautiful iPhone X uh, with a lot of features on it. So I'm focusing right now on most the things or most the features on that phone. So if you have already a jailbroken device, you can use most the uh, features on your jailbroking device and i'm focused today in today's video on about the new multitask or the new gestures so everybody knows once you see the apple event when they present the uh, a new iphone x they talking about the new way of the multitask how you open your multitask without a bond because the uh, the bond will be not anymore available on the new iphone 10 or the iphone x so in today's video i bring one of the tweaks that's already been around from about like four to five years ago that tweak is already bring the same style that we see on apple event and talking about that and i'm going to be explaining most of the things on that in today's video to show you guys how you can open your multitask just like so and then the other thing you can swipe from the bottom to open your control center in my opinion is going to be better from the top corner just like the same stuff as i show you guys this is the uh how you can open the multitask so talking about the tweak that tweak is called zipper from a long time ago and as you guys can see it's uh, support the iPhone or the version of the uh, uh, 1.4 1.5 to 1.6 Taji which is gonna be this one right there so this is the upgrade or the new tweak for the zipper which is gonna be as you guys can see support the iOS 7 8 9 and also iOS 10 so when you download that week, that week is going to be providing you with the same style that you saw on the new iPhone X, which is if you swap from the uh, corner from here, that's will be bring you to multitask as you guys can see here. And then also, as I show you guys, you can swap from the right corner here. That's going to be bring your control center. My opinion is better than from the uh, swap from the top. Also, if you want to go and launch one of your application and you want to go back right away, so you can swap the same thing as I show you guys. So open your application, swap, and then you will be bam, go back to your home screen. This is how it's going to be the way of the that week to working on your jailbroken device. Let me go right now to show you guys what's going on under the settings. So we have more than section. And then we have a ton of options so uh, one of the options here that is going to be change some stuff and then move some stuff and then you can toggle untoggle enable most of the things which is basically this is the the settings that i use right now on my iDevice so first of all if you want to uh, close the app uh, the same way of the new iphone x so you can enable that section and then the screen area so you can uh, choose uh, the left the, the way that I use it's up to you if you want to use another way the uh, sensitivity here I use the small which is uh, providing you with more than option if you want to use another option the system close here which is really I don't like it I don't know if you guys like it the long swipe up you can tap on this one here and then enable that the system switcher animation so you can uh, close that on or you can toggle that the switcher uh, delay second here it's already set on the point one and uh, the other thing which is going to be or the other section the switch ups here so you can enable that section and then use the number of fingers here so if you tap on it you can use the both fingers or you can use just one finger i already set it on the one finger the other thing which is going to be the screen area 
and the keyboard disable or enable so you can toggle this one here the other section which is going to be the quick switcher so talking about the multitask here and uh, you can enable that section go through some options the same thing that i show you guys before the other thing which is going to be the lock device here so that section i'm not talking about it yet but i'm going to be showing you guys in a second and the other thing which is going to be some other option as i told you it's a lot of option if you want to go through and do that on your iDevice so let me talk right now about the other option which is going to be if you bring your multitask here if i want to go right now to one of the open pages and then just bring that down some extra options here as you guys can see so you can use those if i want to go right now to my home screen and just bring that page down just like so that's going to be provide me with some other options which is i can power off my device from here the same way of the iphone x so the home button as they say in the event it will be for siri but how about if you want to kill your phone or power off your phone so you can use the same thing or it's going to be providing you with more than option which is going to be you can reboot your device you can go to the safe mode from here you can respring your device lock your device and some other stuff so for example if i want to lock my screen from here just like so i already closed my device and this is the way of that tweak so this is how is the way of the tweak when you download the tweak or set the tweak on your iDevice pretty much is going to be bring most of the features on your jailbroken device the same features that is already on the iPhone X as I told you guys I'm focusing right now on most of the tweaks that we have available bring most of the new stuff that we saw already on the new iPhone X and also I'm focusing about most of the stuff right now on the iPhone 8 I'm trying to see most of the tweaks how we can set those and uh, how we can set those and bring most of those features in your jailbroken device so I hope you guys enjoyed today's video if you like the video just make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for my channel for more videos like this and I see you guys in the next video peace